We're about to find out, all being placed away now. Favourite from the inside, Hickory Manelli. Green light goes on. Let's see how he jumps and whether he holds a straight course. He began well. If anything, he edged down to the inside, but they are crowding him, and now he's got into all sorts of trouble. He's back at the tail. In the meantime, going to the front was Arch of Daisies, chasing out after Cold and Dado. Hickory Manelli pulls to the outside. Frodo Baggins are behind those. Maybe wrong. Big finish coming up. Oh, I don't know. Frodo Baggins or Hickory Manelli. Very tight go. Only a nose in it. A real good finish. Nothing between all of them as they hit the line. I think maybe Frodo Baggins a nose in front of Hickory Manelli, but we'll leave it up to the judge. Not far behind those was maybe Ron Colton and Dato and Arch of Daisy standing by for the judge's decision. Good finish. Favourite was a bit stiff if he hasn't got there. Got checked out of it. Came down the outside. Frodo Baggins a roughy of the field surge late or oh, maybe the favorite the favorites got there hickory manelli has got there one two seven one two seven here at murray bridge one two seven the favorite still does get it 1933 was the run one two seven one two seven would have been the best of good things beat had he got beat hickory manelli but it was always going to be a, a little bit of an issue from box one because he wasn't comfortable until he got to the extreme outside. He's a black dog, trained by Ken Gill, raced by T. Aloisi and M. Lehman, by Fabregas out of 